everyone, it's Smitha. Today I'm going to be sharing with you the most basic machine learning algorithm that everyone needs to know. So let's get started. So what is linear regression? Linear regression is basically finding the relationship between two variables x and y. Where x is the independent variable, also known as the predictor, and y is the dependent variable, also known as the response. I believe the best way to learn is through examples. So let's imagine you're a recruiter of a company and you're trying to gauge how much to pay new hires. You have two types of data of your existing employees. You have the number of years of experience they have and their current salary. Since their salary depends on the number of years of experience they have, employee salary will be the Y variable and the number of years of experience will be the X variable. So this is the following data we have. We have data from n number of employees and as you can see the X column cont contains all the number of years of experience each employee has and the Y column contains the salary of each employee. And if you were to plot all these points on a graph, you would probably get something like this. So let's say you want to hire someone completely new to the company who has about 5 years of experience. How much would you decide to pay them? So this is where linear regression comes in. You're going to have to draw a best fit line for all of these points. So as you guys will probably know, learning it probably from school, the equation of a straight line is actually y equals to mx plus c, where m is the gradient and c is the y-intercept. So how do we determine this equation? How do we determine the values of m and c? Well, one way we could is by hand drawing a straight line through all the points. But that is going to be extremely difficult as our data set gets bigger and bigger. In this example, I'm going to show you one of the many ways that you can find the equation of this straight line. First of all, uh, just download the data set from the link in the description box below. So for this example, to plot our straight line, I'm going to be using Plotly. It's such a great tool, especially if you're a beginner in machine learning and data science. I didn't want to get into any code for this particular example. Maybe in my future videos, I will start coding in it. But for this one, I just wanted it to be accessible to everyone. So let's begin. Uh, go to create and click chart. So we're going to have to import the CSV file that we just downloaded. Click import and upload. Once we have the CSV file uploaded, it will probably look something like this. So the first column will show you guys the years of experience and the second column will show you guys the salary. Right now the plot is empty because we have not traced it yet. So let's actually do that. So click trace. It's going to be of type scatter. There are a bunch of other types, but for now, let it just let it be. And for the X values, let's choose years of experience because as I said, that would be the X coordinates and Y would be salary. So there you go. These are all our points which have been plotted onto the graph. So now how do we get the straight line? We're going to go to analyze, click on curve fitting, click on fit and select trace zero. Trace zero is basically this, our first trace right here. It's just default name is trace zero. Trace zero, you have basic and we get to choose the type of uh, fit that we want. We want a linear line. So we're just going to click linear. As you can see here, it also has the linear equation y equals to mx plus b, also sometimes known as y equals to mx plus c. But anyway, so once we click run, it's actually going to plot the straight line through, which is going to be the best fit line for all of these points. And it's also going to give us the estimate for the values of m, which is the gradient, and b, which is the y-intercept. So if we take the values that we got for m and b and put it back into the equation, 
this is the model that we get. This is essentially our really, really basic machine learning model uh, that we got from doing linear regression. So let's revisit the question that I asked way back in the beginning. So we have John here and he's a potential new employee and he has five years of experience. So let's use our model to deduce how much we would pay John. Since he has five years of experience, we would simply substitute x equals to five into the equation. And in doing so, we get y equals to 73,551. So this is the potential salary of John. We can go on to use this model to estimate the salary of many other future employees with many different years of experience. The number of years of experience of the future employees doesn't have to be limited in the range of the current data that we, that we have. It can be outside the data as well and this model will work for that as well. So let's do a recap of what we've learned. We've learned how to use the basics of linear regression and also basically how it works. We've also learned to use the existing data of our current employees to create a model. And we have used that particular model to predict future scenarios of hiring future employees and determining how their salaries would be. I know there was a lot of information to take in, but it's fine if you didn't understand everything because I'll be making a lot more videos like this on machine learning fundamentals. So be sure to subscribe and stay tuned for those. And leave a comment down below if you have any questions and I'll be sure to get back to you on that. Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to like, comment and subscribe and see you guys next time.